puppies. <laughs> I really wanted to do that. It's not exactly how I had it in my mind, but I'm actually really pr proud that I actually did it and didn't say, hey, hi, awkwardly. Anyways, so puppies, puppies. Saying that word now, because I didn't know what I was going to talk about. Saying the word, just puppies, it's puppies. A lot of puppies are really ugly or just not inspiring cuteness but there's your thought number one <laughs> not all puppies are cute they aren't and to say a side note and we're talking about puppies but i want to make this an official statement of arena kittens are ugly they just are now when they're like older they're really cute and then they become ugly cats again but kittens kittens the ones that you see on kitten calendars why do people find that cute they're not cute and a lot of puppies aren't either but yeah you know babies of animals are endearing because we're animals and sorry if you don't believe in that i guess just like animals to our babies are our pets except etc see baby humans differently lions etc they see they, you just like instinctively see this creature that cannot defend itself and unless you're a predator of that creature then you're going to be like either what is this i'll just leave it alone or like oh maybe i should help it because it's gonna die by itself anyways there's your topic number two puppies are dogs private citizens and puppy porn should I, can I even say that word? I probably won't be able to say that word. So this came from my boyfriend, our dog's private citizens. He had this thought that he just gave to me like, here, talk about this. But it's a thought that I have thought about when I put my dog on Instagram. Would she be okay with it? Which, I mean, it's really weird, but we are really in charge of their whole life. They don't get a say. Maybe they don't want to be public on Instagram. Maybe they don't want to have their picture taken and put out there as a puppy, as a vulnerable thing. Or maybe they don't like the angle the picture is taken at. Or they wouldn't, obviously, because they don't see it right now. But yeah, they don't really seem to have the same rights and laws. Because it's also kind of impossible to communicate that. That sucks for them. The other thing, the thing that I was saying that I probably can't say, so I'm going to censor it out. Because he mentioned this too. A lot of compromising positions that these puppies and dogs are in. We get to see a lot of their bodies, so to speak, without clothing on. Especially in those areas that we would for sure clothe ourselves or else we would get censored. I've not seen censored puppy videos or censored dog videos or any animal being censored, you know, the specific areas that we would censor for ourselves. That's definitely food for thought. Probably doesn't lead you anywhere, but just, huh. And then you move on for your day. I don't know. That's kind of all I have to say about that. I just, just that I thought about that and he thought about that. And when he said that, I'm like, yeah, I, I guess I do want to talk about it. Or did I mention him? What else about puppies? I'm cold right now. Oh, I have, I have to see. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, puppies. I have a puppy. She's, is she technically a puppy? She's like a year and a half. I feel like she's a, not what the American cliche of a teenager is, but she's, I guess, technically a teenager, right? Or like a middle schooler. Full of energy. Adorable. And the thing that gets to me most that just like, I just laugh. I find it so attractive. That's a, that's a weird word to use with dogs. Not like sexually attract. Obviously not attractive in that sense. It pulls me to bother her even more because she gets really bothered when she's sleeping and you go to pet her or anything or move her because you're trying to get in bed too on your side and she's on your side or taking the whole bed. And you move her and she growls like her 
her lip kind of quiver quivers and her teeth kind of show sometimes when it's like really like oh i mean it she never means it but it's so funny to me and endearing endearing is the word not attractive endearing is the word that i was she is like hating me but i just i'm laughing it's kind of torture i guess <laughs> talk about private citizen you know laws the other thing she does is with us at least i would not suggest anyone do this with someone else's dog she protects her bone if you touch it and take it she stops but if your hand is close to her face when she's like and she's hiding like the bone underneath her head like that so you don't see it <laughs> she growls again and shows her teeth but she stops when you take it it's so funny she is she's a woman she's female for sure because i say that because i think that there's a protective of your kids instinct in females of animals that females gave give birth and <laughs> like where that happens i don't know if there's any animal that's reverse i think they just have an extra protective instinct even over food or anything so i think that's where she and she is also the breed is more of a protective dog she likes her house and her house is like don't come near the house stranger go away but yeah we're kind of deviating from puppies i mean she is a puppy but we're not talking about her necessarily any other puppy things i started looking at llamas that is not a puppy but i say that because a lot of people look at puppy videos puppy pictures puppy instagrams i mean they're cute but i don't know it gets old and most of the puppies out there are so not cute just like people say about babies human <laughs> <sighs> human babies i think that's all i have to say about puppies i kind of mentioned in my previous video check it out it's my like oh i'm coming back video and like where things are this might be a minute long it might be 15 it might be half an hour but highly unlikely to be half an hour or longer and it's kind of close to the 15 mark it's nine minutes right now <laughs> after editing it's probably going to be probably not that much shorter because i it was pretty like flowy but um and when what i edit in these videos is mostly for creative reasons or pauses and yeah but the other thing too is because ooh, this is a, another topic for another day when i edit movies i am really fast paced with my editing i'm like go 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 you know like i do have a sixth sense for editing and for pacing but i just have a fast pace usually and definitely with my youtube so i don't know how this will turn out because i'm going to probably want to try different editing things and not edit as much and this is only 10 minutes so far so i might not edit it at all there were a couple edits that i i want to make for creative reasons but besides that i might just leave it with pauses and things and see how it goes because why not i talk fast i feel anyways and with a lot of energy a lot of like energy but anyway so that was my video on puppies <laughs> not dogs not dogs just puppies i have this like puppy in my head you've definitely seen it it's a very popular puppy picture i think it's been on some notebooks as well like i think it's a basset hound puppy or something not that cute he's not ugly but he's not that cute my puppy was cute oh she was so cute but again not when she was super super little and short-haired puppies are cuter just like cats too adult cats that are short-haired i'm okay with my friend has two long-haired cats except that i like the one because i saw him as a kitten when he was a cute kitten i bonded with it i guess and he has a pretty coloring but i don't like the long hair i don't I know. And part of that is because I grew up with it's not healthy. You're inhaling all of that and it's all over you. And it's just like, no. But on the other hand, we also shed too. That's dust. That's dust in our house and everything. That's our, our skin and our hair. So I know you can argue that. This is deviating. Puppies, I'm freezing. I'm going to go. Have a wonderful day. Go see some puppies. Make, you know, your ch your choice, your decision about whether puppies are cute. Is there such a thing as an ugly puppy? Leave your comment down below, as they say here on YouTube. Cool. All right. I'll talk to you later. Oh, oh, you know what? I'm going to I'm going to try this. I'm going to debut this. If it works, if it works right here, right here.
so if it works, you'll see this part of the segment. If it doesn't work, you won't. And you'll just see, I'll just cut this out. Well, you won't know. <laughs> if it works, I'll put down here or somewhere in the description, etc. a voicemail. I got this inspired by Dave Neal. I'm going to shut him out. Shut him out. Shout him out. <laughs> on that because he inspired this i love that for the longest time when i've done anything on youtube on facebook on instagram live etc i've wanted to communicate with people i want them to communicate back and not just in comments but in voice and i saw him do that i'm like wow genius like that is what i've wanted to do and it, it works so beautifully for him i don't know if it'll work for me but leave a comment down below call the voicemail number leave a voicemail is there such a thing as a, an ugly puppy? That's the question for the day. That's the poll for today and for this video. All the other topics or all the other points of this video, eh, there weren't that many. I think there were like, what, three, two, one. But is there such a thing as an ugly puppy? Let me know. Cool. Have a wonderful day and I'll talk to you later. Hopefully in better lighting. Hopefully in better video quality. But, you know, we'll see. Cool. Bye. Puppies. Puppies. A lot of puppies are really ugly or just not inspiring. Censored puppy videos or censored dog videos or any animal. Like her, her lip kind of quiver, quivers and like the bone underneath her head like that so you don't see it. Yeah.